Hello and welcome back. We are in the spa. Oh, more stuff? Okay. After this, we might be just rich. And uh, if nothing else, the, the all the stuff we find, we might be able to use for crafting. And uh, even if we can't trade for a lot. That I do hope to find. So, a lot of traders. Junk. That would be the best if you can actually just trade for some uh, higher level item from the start. That's why we need high merchantry as well. I don't know what other type of characters are in the game. Uh, we can work with these. Yeah, faded jewels. Mimic, go away! Am I just getting lucky here? What is this double storeroom? I don't even question it. Uh oh. Oh wow. Can't open it. That's that's rare. Because he's actually pretty good at that. I made sure. More storage rooms? No, it's gonna be a fight, right? <gasps> Rest? Amazing. Seems like four rest is enough. Four overwatch is just fine. We don't need to max it necessarily. Well done. I've never managed to fail it. I suppose it's really hard to fail it. But of course the terror always goes up. Alright. Hmm. Uh, more storage rooms, please. I suppose. Oh, a bigger van down. What? The hell? Okay, this is just getting ridiculous. Um, let's just sing a song. <laughs> storage room, rest, storage room, rest. Do I rest? A little bit of health. The guy's roommate is like all fine. I can't afford it. This is kind of crazy. Alright, let's go. Indian head. Is this some kind of tavern? Oh. A fight! Spill the enemy's blood without mercy. What? No, 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 I haven't seen these guys before. The enemies, at least. Oh, he's shielding right away. Golem cannon guard. Wow. Golem guard. Golem Cannon Guard is actually damn scary. Arcus the Ghost seems like an excellent candidate for getting murdered. Do I want to just poison everybody? Oh, that ghost is gonna die. Okay. The ghost is gonna act. If I hit the ghost... But well, then it's gonna die eventually. I can just hit the Ghoulam Guard, and Victor kills the Arcaster Ghost. Yes, that's how we roll. Let's do the poison. Five damage? Wow. Kill the good thing about that is that she rarely takes damage. Killing the golem cannon guard would be amazing. And I can't kill the golem guard. I tried to kill the cannon guard in the back. Actually, you might be able to do a double hit on them. Mm. 
It cannot be done. Ah, uh, Golem Cannon Guard. It's gonna act now. There's not much we can do about this. Just go for one hit. This is kind of fine. Oh, he's shielding again. That's actually preferable than him using any kind of attack on me. But makes it tricky to kill him. This guy's tank as hell. Can't even kill the Golem Guard either. I can do free damage, but it's not gonna be enough to kill him. I don't wanna kill the, the Golem Cannon Guard instead. Wow. Eight damage in this fight alone. Rip in peace. One in the back was actually pretty uh, weak. Poison! It needs one more hit. Whoa, golem parts? Can I use this to make a golem? And that's it. We can just head out to this place. The last room was the only one that's dangerous. Two storage room and two rests. Okay. But I suppose this is uh, kind of RNG. I don't know if there's some logic to it. Uh, maybe we go this way. Dwarf King Yen. Again, we're getting very close. And at this point... We are in the green, basically. All our all our sliders are pretty high up. His is the his health is the lowest, and he's in the front. Other than that, we are pretty good. Oh my God, Merchant Man! Ooh, is that a critical success? So he's selling these things. Bigger six. Bigger, more valuable. It costs more to fill vigor than it is to fill health. It seems like that is the case. And if you buy a bigger package, it's always more valuable. More bang for your buck. Buy invest. You can buy a divining rod. Which gives me awareness. But cuts down on the, the slide. So, this allows one character to basically avoid all the traps. Cheap perfume. I think this cheap perfume up upgraded actually becomes something that doesn't take away from your uh, combat. This Divining Rod seems like an okay choice. But currently I'm not really struggling too much with traps. So do I really want to buy the Divining Rod? Just to have the option of using it with possibly some other party setup? That seems maybe questionable. But I don't always have the option to buy it. And do I want to buy a Lavo Cocktail? Alright, let's see. Fur vest is kind of crappy. We probably don't want to use it. I can sell it. Is it heavy? It was actually 8 uh, weights. You can just sell a bunch of ropes. A bunch of scrap metal. A bunch of junk. We're gonna need some space. We can at least sell some less valuable and more common materials. Okay, let's sell some rope. We're gonna need some space to carry the stuff. 
that we hopefully are gonna find. Okay. I'm, I'm kind of hesitant to leave his stock. But I don't want to bring a divining rod just not to use it. Ah, and I don't want that. I suppose combat one is still useful. I might go with uh, one or two lava cocktails. How heavy is this? Two. So we're going to bring one as like an insurance. Thanks. Oh, some stuff. Ah, oh, come on, Mimic. Avoiding traps is almost guaranteed at this point. I don't think we can buy better stuff, currently. We need to get to the next area in the game. But this team might be able to pull it off. What? I can rest? Yeah, we gotta be careful. Not to get too greedy. Yeah, that always works. Goes up. And I think we still wanna heal as well. This is not an extremely long area. Okay. Nice! So Lyric is not dying. And the team is pretty useful. And for some reason I'm getting pretty lucky with the events. Okay, okay. Sometimes we gotta fight. But that's reasonable. Alright. We gotta go through four rooms. With our current plan. Uh oh. Ambush. We can poison everybody. Rioter, our caster ghost. I just poison everybody. This kind of makes sense with the current party setup because Vosper just poisons everybody and the rest of them come a little later. But the poison is not like spot removal. You can't just like nuke someone with it. So, we are pretty bad at the round one, but. We usually get stronger and wipe them out. So we can do a, a big hit on everybody. Our cast to go ghost is a little annoying. I don't know if I want to be do a big shot on everybody. Is that still the same skill? Three long range targets and attract them to the caster. And they deal one less damage and you deal one damage. This is only good. The problem with this skill is that you take a crap ton of damage. And if you keep using it, you're just gonna have one character that's very damaged and you don't have a way to heal one character like a lot unless you're using consumables, which is, I suppose, is reasonable and you probably have to do it later. So he's probably gonna be better once I'm more committed to using consumables. Poison! Okay, finishing blow on the ghost. What? Miss! Who still needs to die? So we managed to kill three characters by the time they managed to come again, which is not too bad. So grand total, they managed to come five times. Just go for the finishing head. Well done. They did have something. Yeah, maybe less fights. Fights are not as valuable as finding storerooms. I wonder if 
Oh, there's actually a, a way to use like Raven or crap like that. I don't use it though. Befuddled for all, avoided. Thankfully. Uh oh. Keep a wary eye. I'm not sure what he gives to me. I, I guess Victor maybe can chance it. Let's hear what you have to say, man. Oh, we got a lava cocktail? That's actually fairly valuable. I might start skipping some conversations that are just keep coming up over and over again. Like this one. Because this was not the first time we met this uh, ghost man. <gasps> Another storage room? Unbelievable. Avoided. I just we just find so much stuff. I like it. Uh, did I go the right way? Yes. So we need to. No, no, no. We need to wait for the next thing. Dunk. No, a fight! Oh, who are these guys? Mad survivors. They are weak. Uh, maybe we can kill the second one? I can poison the one mad survivor, but this is a kill. So we have. Oh, this is not a kill. We would have been able to prevent the damage it deals. Wow. Holy crap, they deal damage. Killing that guy would have been awesome. Very dangerous, but also very weak. So, this is the time where my low initiative team is punished. Do I want to use that ability just to prevent free damage? Poss well, most likely at least free damage. Well, like, let's say average free damage. If I don't do this, and I have to go for a regular hit, that's most likely not gonna be a critical. And uh, Vosper hits as well. Somewhat questionable, but we definitely get something out of it. Get hit less. Ah, let's just get the fuck out of here. I actually went the wrong way. What the fuck? We're gonna get. Yeah, we lost vigor because I went the wrong way. I was right, wasn't I? I just assumed that I was wrong. But no, I was right. We had to come this way. Uh, we could have prevented a fight, plus one bigger loss, because we had to backtrack. We are almost there. Not, not sure where is there, but we're definitely almost where there is. This is the club. One before the last thing. Oh, more stuff. Don't mind if I do. Oh, break that. <gasps> this rarely happens. I think he has one in five chance to uh, mess it up. No, let's not do that. Take it. Okay, where do we want to go? So, I don't have to turn in there. And I, I don't think I want to risk here. So, we're just going to go straight ahead.
We're gonna go straight ahead. Another storage room? What the hell? It's gotta be affected by our luck. I'm finding way too many of these things. Just because you're somewhat lucky doesn't mean your life is all storage rooms, right? And skip this room and just go straight up. A little, still a little confused about the map. Oh, we can campfire. Oh, that's perfect. Because our vigor is going a little low. And also our health. At least Vospar's health is slightly low. Nice. Can I use this? Yes. Just because we have a Shadow Master in the team doesn't mean we can use the Raven. It's the Shadow Master who has to be the one who organizes the rest. Then we can do it. Okay, I'm running a little low, so... If we find another camp... That's gonna be okay, but... Not like I have infinite health and uh, vigor here. Gonna run out eventually. Like getting attacked. What? Just a bunch of mimics. Yeah, avoided. Keep a wary eye. We're pretty good at avoiding traps. Eerie dog. You find the ghosty dog blocking your path. It watches you with a calm but curious with calm but cur curious eyes. Nothing about his demeanor seems threatening. Then again, who can presume to know the mind of a Supernatural beast. Do I want to interact with it? Let's do it. Actually, this is probably a bad idea. You step closer to the dog as it continues to sit calmly. You slowly kneel, holding out your hand. When the ghost dog sees your gesture, it suddenly lashes out, mauling you with sharp teeth before running off into the dark. Elf too doesn't matter. Ha! Huh. Come on. Don't make me laugh. It would have been pretty bad if we got some uh, combat minus one, something like that. I don't want that. But health too? Come on, don't make me laugh. We lost what another vigor, but why? Oh, combat. Spell the enemy's blood without mercy. Oh, what? What is this band? Back pretty soon. They're damage crazy now. And they have a lot of health. I guess we're just gonna poison them. The poison clouds! But now. What? They attack twice? not good. I don't know if I wanna focus them on Victor. Maybe I should. They're gonna deal less damage. Victor is the second most wounded. Necro is gonna die. It, yeah, they attack twice anyway. So, lowering their damage by one was pretty sensible. But that move prevented four damage. The Necro is gonna die. Necro Slave is just dying. doing here I can hit that and it's gonna go down to one health but it's not gonna help us too much right now so I guess we're working on it I 
You can't kill the one in the back. This necro slave should be dead in one hit. But the problem is, who is gonna come? Uh, that's Victor. And then he has the choice between hitting either of these. I can't hit the necro slave in the back. They always attack twice. But that's not clearly stated. Put in peace. What about the guy in the back? Okay, poison should kill it. This one dies from poison. Poison Master is pretty good. Boss Par. Good addition to the team. Stuff. Oh, Necro Dust. Fully on chip. We're almost full on items. And Boss Par took some proper damage last time. Hopefully no more fights. Oh, uh, maybe a maybe a rest, you know? If I can oh, storeroom? Why storeroom? Just give me rest. Oh, storeroom and the rest? Alright, game. Fine. I'll I'll take it. <gasps> mm, and uh the exit is pretty close. Well done. And uh, heal a little bit as well. We need that. Terror goes up, but it doesn't matter. Yeah. Although Vosper is actually. Fuck. I messed up. I should have used one healing thingy on Vosper. I was too, too quick here. I'm not sure what, what I'm saving it for, because this. Really should have been the time to use it. What the fuck? <laughs> a healing? At the end? Are you fucking kidding me? Wait. Oh. Use it on... Boss bar? I think we want to do that, then call it quits, maybe. Nothing else we need to do. Okay, this is not like a proper heal healing place. This is just, you know, if you want to use consumables, now is the time. This is the type of healing place. Maybe we want to use a small one on him. We have one. Bigger of six. Nah, we might just go with this. This is decent. Alright, break camp. We've seen enough. Apparently, next time we go to the big boss. I don't know what that's gonna be. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. See you next time.